you guys how's it going remember this thing yeah let me know what you guys think I uh, got a new video um, I think I never made this video I should have um, this is a video on the um, Nick Wu 2 custom knife from a long long time ago he had a contest back when he had like 30 subs 37 I think I was his 38th subscriber and he had a contest uh, I think for 25 up or 50 up I forget but uh, he's, I won and uh, I was so glad I won I won this awesome little knife um, I did manage to lose the sheath somehow when I went um, to the park or kind of a hiking park so I had to make one and this is one of my very first uh, sheath sheath and I messed up on it I forgot I didn't really I thought three rivets would be enough but I should put another one the retention is not great it's actually gonna fall out but uh, it's okay it's not really sheath I would say it's more of a just a case so when I put it away it's not gonna get scratched and it'll be fine in your pocket so yeah but let's go over it um, I did refinish it because I started to get some rust on it a while ago after testing it a lot. But um, it's mostly all original. It just did a nice little polishing on the G10. It came great from from Nick. And being one of his first custom knives, uh, hand, hand forged, I believe, there are a few little gaps that he left in the steel in the G10. So I filled those in with titanium. Uh, resin titanium powdered resin or something like that so it's nice and smooth down no water is going to get in there that's the only purpose so what this is is one of his uh first slow neck knives with the three finger grip and uh g10 on the blade which is uh pretty unusual but pretty freaking cool got two uh 16th inch or eighth inch pins eighth inch pins and a freaking wicked edge. Um, he really knows how to do his heat treat. I'm not sure if it's still sharp, guys. Do I use it a lot? Uh, it's actually the family uh, letter opener. But no, still sharp. You know, it's a little, it's a little sticky, but um, uh, you know what? Still pretty sharp. Probably just got a little nick in there, but uh, this thing's holding edge great. It's 1095, I believe. Yeah, it's got a little nick here in the middle, but uh, but it's pretty freaking sharp, um, and it's really comfortable. Uh, spear drop design. Let me get this crap out of here. Yeah, so spear drop. Shape uh, full high convex, which I convexed it. I think it came high, full high convex. I forget, but uh, as you can see, a really nice black G10, and uh, this thing's great. Like I said, the family letter opener, and it gets it's, it gets used quite a bit. You can see it's pretty scratched up on the blade, and I think he used titanium resin too. Because look, it's gray around the edges but uh I did the titanium too. Um I mean it's not a super freaking big chopper knife. It's a really really nice little neck knife and I think he's making some production knives now which are pr pretty cool. I've seen them. Sadly I couldn't comment on the video because I can't with the mobile. Yeah I won't really you know I'm getting like something like spider web or something. Um See, it bites into wood, but this is it's a really small knife, so it shouldn't really bite in really deep. And you can hear that this thing's freaking solid as heck. Yeah, I don't think I have any softer wood. That wood's incredibly freaking hard. Here's my first ever knife handle. That's not even a knife; it's a practice handle. I wanted to learn how to do the Anzo pattern. It's the first time I ever did it. Um, 
came out pretty freaking good, but it's not really comfortable for uh, with a thumb ramp. It's really only comfortable like that. But this is my original handle shape. I'll make a video on that later. It's a good talk. Alright. Oh, yeah, but I was going to just cut this. It's bicing pretty well. I mean, it's a thick, thick blade. Look at that. It's pretty thick, including that G10. So it's really not meant to cut uh, wood. It's meant to cut paper and stuff, you know, small, small things. Um, string on your shirt. Uh, but it's a great freaking knife. And uh, you guys want one, don't hesitate to get checked out his channel and uh, he has some production ones ready for sale. Yeah, still shaves hair. It's just that little nick in there. I don't want to cut myself with it, but uh, yeah, guys, thank you for watching. Nick Wu too. Awesome. All right. What was this uh, outro? Um, have a good day, guys. Nick Wu too. Nick Wu too. How do you do at the beginning and then? Yeah, I don't remember that, but uh. Yeah, guys, Nick with two custom knife. Let me know, guys, what you guys think. Pretty freaking sweet. Alright, guys, take care. I'll see you guys next video. Take care. Later.